City of Pueblo trying to figure out what to do with the five star variance program that had been in the works, which would allow more capacity for restaurants for counties under level red. But the county can now operate at the lower level orange. So what happens now? News size Natalie Chuck live with an update on the status of this program. Natalie. Good evening, Elizabeth. Yeah, now that businesses and restaurants here in Pueblo are able to operate in the level orange on the COVID-19 dial, plans for the variance program have gotten a little bit more complicated. I spoke with one restaurant owner today who also sits on the board that is trying to get the variance program up and running, and here is what she had to say. Like many other restaurants in Pueblo, Graham's Grill is finally seeing customers inside. We're happy that we're open today. Um, it's a little bit infuriating, kind of how it happened. Owner Heather Graham is referring to the unexpected announcement from the state that restaurants can now operate in level orange. Meanwhile, the city of Pueblo had been working hard to start a variance program that would have allowed businesses to operate in level orange while Pueblo was in level red. Nobody really thought that the governor was going to move us, you know, faster than the five star came out. But he did. So where does that leave the program? Right now, no businesses in Pueblo are able to operate in level yellow until the state gives the go ahead. Our metrics were not uh, where they should have been in the dial to move us. Uh, from level red um, to level orange. Uh, I believe the state made that decision uh, due to uh, a lot of input and uh, pressure from counties across the state. Businesses were supposed to submit detailed prevention plans on how they would be keeping their customers safe. Graham is frustrated to say the least. That kind of sucks because every, you know, everyone's trying so hard to get certified, so instead of 25%, we can actually operate at 50%. And so that's kind of another reason why I feel like it kind of lost its luster. But she says the program is still worth considering in the event that Pueblo's coronavirus cases rise again. You know, it will really save um, businesses if we ever get put back in the red. You'll still be able to operate at 10 percent. Graham says if and when the variance program becomes available, Graham's Grill is ready to apply. Pueblo's variance program, the application was actually sent in today to the state and is currently awaiting approval. In the meantime, we'll have more details linked for you over on our website, koaa.com. Always watching out for you, Pueblo. Natalie Chuck, News 5.